to explain both sides of this contentious issue. Emily? One side sees the proposed law as a police officer safety issue and the other side sees it as a police officer accountability issue. And both sides were here at the State House today to testify in front of lawmakers. They're constantly being spit on. They're constantly, okay. you know, putting themselves in danger. And that's why Indiana State Representative Wendy McNamara says she wrote House Bill 1186 to better protect officers at scenes. The Republican lawmaker testified in support of the bill Tuesday. This is about creating that safe space. Under the proposed law, an officer would be able to order bystanders to step back 25 feet from a scene for whatever reason or face arrest themselves. This 25-foot perimeter will give a police officer the legal authority to have people who are causing unnecessary problems to step back. Those who oppose the bill say it would keep the public from being able to observe police officers clearly and record their actions if they had concerns. In recent years, there have been numerous tragic deaths at the hands of police that were observed and recorded by civilian bystanders, and that's been critical in pushing back on unchecked police brutality. The majority of our officers are doing really good work and, and don't have those issues that have made national news. Plainfield's police chief Kyle Pruitt, who also represents the more than 300 members of the Indiana Association of Chiefs of Police says cell phone technology makes the distance argument invalid. Most modern cell phone cameras are going to capture 25 feet very, very well. We wanted to see what 25 feet looked like zoomed in on a cell phone, so we got out a tape measure and marked off the distance. Then we zoomed in on a cell phone and hit record. Here's how it looked. But even if the picture is clear from 25 feet away. You're not going to get the audio very well um, from 25 feet away of what's going on. Lawmakers who oppose 1186 say the bill's language is too open to interpretation and worry how officers will implement the law. I think this is going to cause more problems than sa uh, save any officers' lives. And 1186 passed out of committee today by a vote of 5 to 2. It's now headed to the Senate where other lawmakers can propose changes. At the State House, Emily Longnecker, 13 News.